What's up guys, it's me, your badass host Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough. Okay, so, here's the final part to the Team Rocket Saga right here. But before we do anything, there is a little something that you guys could do on a Sunday. And, well, in this game right here, it is a Sunday. Now, depending on the friendship of your Pokemon, you can go right here into the department store. And you can go to the TM place, which would probably be, I think, the fifth floor right here, right? Could be wrong. Let's see. I was correct. So, again, if it's Sunday, and depending on the friendship of your Pokemon, you can come here and talk to this lady, and she's like, Hello! Oh, you're a Pokemon! It's very attached to you. This move should be perfect for a pair like you. You get yourself the TM27. And for those who don't know, TM27 is... <laughs> it's returned. There's... There are sure to be TMs that are just perfect for your Pokemon. Okay. And I believe if your Pokemon doesn't like you, she will also give you the TM28, which is frustration. You know, that kind of stuff right there. Now, we will be needing that TM27 because it could prove useful for a Pokemon that is high on friendship. And I have the perfect Pokemon that I could give it to. Let me see, let's see, where is that, where is that little thing? Oh yes, TM27 return. All I gotta do is boot it up, and we are gonna give that to Teddy. Because of its high physical attack. And, uh, well, delete one move. What move should I delete? Hmm. It's really tough. I still need Lick for just a little bit. Eh... Yeah. Yeah, okay, you know what? I'm just gonna get rid of Lick right here. Don't really need it that much, but eventually we'll we'll get back to it. So Teddy earned the lick attack or the return attack. It gets powerful every single time your Pokemon be well likes you. Or if your Pokemon likes you that much, it's gonna be super powerful. Won't well, nobody nobody will be able to stop it now. If your Pokemon faints at some point, its attack weakens every single time. So just make sure and try not to let your Pokemon faint so many times. Okay, so now back into the radio tower. We got the card key to go into the fourth or the third floor to get to the external part of this whole radio tower right here. Now, I don't know how they have a how they have a a signal that can control Pokemon, but that is kind of effed up if you if you'd ask me. And so here we go. Card key, card key is in the slot, and there we go. Round three for every Team Rocket member. He's like, why did? The shutter open. Did you have something to do with this? Probably. Alrighty. Okay, so let's see what we can do right here with this guy. He thinks he's pretty awesome. He thinks he's tough. He's coming out with his Raticade. Okay. I'm coming out with this guy right here. Let's go with that return attack that we've been talking about. And as you can see, <clears throat> a lot of a lot of damage right there. Alrighty, okay. You know, I'm gonna continue on with Titty Teddy right here. Titty Teddy. I almost said Titty Teddy. Why? And there we go. Hmm. That return attack is actually pretty good. Teddy loves us. Oh my god. Oh my god. And he's like, I'm done for. Yes, you are. You're done for. Okay. Um, I just realized something, too. Lucky is close to level 35, and it's about to learn a very powerful move, so I should defeat most of these guys with them. And here we go. Stop! I'm known as a Team Rocket Fortress. You're not taking another step. Well, that's new. Team Rocket Fortress? Yeah, that, that's new. Oh, wow, it's an executive. Oh, never mind. So this guy comes out with a gold bat. Okay, Mr. Fortress. And, yeah, okay, never mind. His Pokemon's at level 36. This is a very powerful Pokemon right here. We're in for a good battle. Here we go. Trying to make us flinch every freaking time. Oh my god. Stop it. And there we go. Ice Punch doesn't beat him right now, but we can beat him right there and then. But there's that Confuse Ray that 
will more than likely screw us over right here. Let's go. Come on. Come on! Oh my god! I hate you. Alright, let's use that bitter, bitter berry. Hmm. Probably should have thought this through right here. This Golba is freaking fast. Okay. Ice Punch. Oh my god. Stop attacking us, you jerk! Yeah. Oh, almost takes out that Golbat and... Oh, it's hitting us with that wing attack. Nearly beats us right there. But, there we go, Ice Punch. Takes care of that situation. Yeah, and Relic grows to level 43 without even battling right there. And this guy's like, the fortress came down! Yeah, pretty much. Alright, um... Yeah, let's... Let, let's just give him potions because... This is ridiculous. Alrighty, that's one. Here comes another one. Still not enough. Well, we'll just leave it at that. Well, let's go ahead and take on this girl. And she's like, don't I, or don't I think Pokemon are cute? I'll think my Pokemon are cute after they beat yours. Yeah, some of these people are just like, scary, brutal. They're just scared. And here we go with Cassidy, you know, from the Pokemon anime, because it kind of looks just like her. It really does. And, well, Mud Slap. Let's finish it off with Mud Slap. Oh, yeah. Critical hit. Bye bye. More experience points. Hmm. Okay, so, she's coming out that Oddish! Huh. Hmm. Okay. It's been a while since we faced an Oddish, but, you know, this should be an easy task for, uh, for Lucky right here. Mm hmm. Well, that was easy. It really was. Okay, two more Pokemon. Coming out with Gloom. Let's just continue on with this guy. I really want to get that Earthquake attack right now. We're at that good point where we can actually uh, have some extremely powerful attacks here. And there we go. Gloom is down. Out for the count. Relic, of course, not battling, but still gaining experience points because he's a jerk like that. Or she. I don't know. Whichever she is. He, she. I don't know. Not genderizing, just forgot it's gender. Mm hmm And there goes that Atkins. Hmm. Okay, so that was it. He's like, oh no, they're useless they're so useless. They kinda are. I love my beautiful self. Who cares about Pokemon? Alright. Talk to her. Why? Why do they have to suffer through this? Meowth, help me! Yeah, that Meowth won't do anything at all. Won't do anything for you. And I think we're at the end of this whole thing right here, so let's just battle this chick right here. And she's like, remember me from the hideout in the in Mahogany Town? I lost then, but I won't lose this time. Okay. Let's see what happens. Here's the executive that we battled before, and she wants to battle with her Cobra. I mean, Arbok. Okay. Bring it on, Arbok. I mean, Cobra. Or Cobra, Arbok. I don't know. Mud Slap. And before we even get a Mud Slap off, this girl just, like, hits us with the Rap Attack. But there's that Mud Slap. And it's strong. It's very, very strong. And, yep, your accuracy just failed, but you're still hitting me with this thing. I don't like it. Let's go with uh, something else. Something very strong. Something better. Come on. Come on, sir. Make it faint. It's making it rain, but it's making it faint. And it almost faints, but this guy will not let me go. Jeez, okay. Ice punch. And luckily that glare didn't hit us. That would have paralyzed us. That would have been bad. Very bad right there. Oh, yeah. Okay, who's next? Vileplume. Oh, she's coming out with her best Pokemon right now. Yeah, this Pokemon looks brutal. With the Ice Punch, and uh, there's that Absorb Attack, so that's going to be a problem for us right here. Because we're four times weaker to Grass-type Pokemon. So we need to finish this Pokemon real quick, or else it's going to finish us off. 
And that Ice Punch does a lot of damage, but will it be enough to defeat this Pokemon? I don't know. As you can see, bam! Takes care of, oh wow, takes care of Lucky just like that. Alright, let's go to Cinder. You just effed with the wrong Pokemon right here. Before we do anything, I gotta revive that Pokemon. I has to. I gots to. That's what I has to do. Where are you? There you are. Alright, so Lucky's been revitalized. And, uh, well that sweet scent won't do anything. But here's the coolest move in the game. Fire or Flame Wheel. Oh yeah. Bye bye Vile Plume. Not so lucky right now. And okay. Got one more Pokemon. I guess I'm gonna go back to Lucky right here. Let's do this. Let's do this. Bring it on, Murkrow. And with a nice punch. Oh, I completely forgot about Nightshade. Hmm. And that was a strong move right there. There we go. Oh, nearly finishes off that Murkrow right there. And come on, you gotta stay lucky. You have to stay. Jesus Christ! Ah, uh, okay. Kid Thunder, let's do this. Okay. Oh God, come on, Lucky. You're not you're not doing me any good right now. You're supposed to be the tank of this group. And that nightshade is not going to be the nightmare. Oh, it's taking out a huge chunk, but you know what? Thunder Punch will do it. Finishes you off, Murkrow. And that was a critical hit. Super effective. And that was mini oh, some minuscule, oh god, minuscule uh, experience points right there. And she's like, this can't be happening. I fought hard, but I still lost. Maybe you should talk to Silver. He'll probably tell you why you didn't uh, beat me. Draven, isn't it? A brat like you won't appreciate the magnificent uh, the magnificence of Team Rocket. That's too bad. I really admire your power. Well, thank you. I admire. Uh, well, you're pretty hot, I guess. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. Whatever. Okay, so more, more, more potions for this guy because he's not becoming lucky right now. And here we have this guy. Oh, you managed to get this far? You must be quite the trainer. We intend to take over the radio station and announce our comeback. That should bring our boss Giovanni back from his solo training. We are going to regain our former glory. I won't allow you to interfere with our plans. And here it is, guys, the final battle against a Team Rocket member or a Team Rocket admin. And this guy looks pretty evil right here. And he's coming out with his Houndour. First time we're looking at a Houndour, we're kind of wondering, where can we get one of these majestic dogs? Eh, uh, well, apparently it's supposed to be in Johto, but we won't be able to see one of these guys until Kanto, which is kind of weird. Yeah, it's weird in itself. And look at that. Oh yeah, critical hit. Eat that. Eat it with a side of Pepsi. Yeah, and he's coming out with his best Pokemon right now, Houndoom. He's panicking, and now this Pokemon looks pretty badass. It's fast, it's tough, and it just hit me pretty hard. Oh god. Oh god! Oh god! Critical hit right there! This Houndoom will not go down. There we go. So it's a battle to the death, and I know that I'm not going to win this one. I am going to use one of them Hyper Potions. Yeah, I will not go down easily. That was a that was a, just a messed up hit right there with the Faint Attack. And this guy's going to go again with his Faint Attack. Oh. Oh, God. Okay, so let's go ahead and oh, take a Bite Attack. Hopefully we don't flinch. We flinched! Oh my god. Stop flinching. Do not flinch. Oh my god. Why have the nickname Lucky if you're the most unluckiest Pokemon ever? Oh god. Bastard ass Houndoom. Yeah, he's he's hitting us pretty hard right here. 
very strong Pokemon right now, and I am getting a little annoyed, and, well, we finally, finally finished this guy off right here. Jeez. Eat it, you freaking Houndoom. Eat it. And bam, level 35, and you know what that means, is learning Earthquake. The move that I've been waiting for. I'm going to take out that Mud Slab right here. Yeah, no more Mud Slab. Here we come with the Murkwick. And uh, come on, bring on that next Pokemon. I don't care who it is. It's going to feel the wrath of Earthquake. Let's go, Lucky. Finish him off with Earthquake. Oh, yeah. And just like that, goodbye, Coffee. That was easy. That was powerful. And there we go. He's been defeated. No, forgive me, Giovanni. How could this be? Our dreams have or our dreams have come to naught. I wasn't up to the task after all. Like Giovanni did before me, I will disband Team Rocket here today. Farewell. See ya. Flipping you guys off wherever you guys disappear to. And here we go with the director. He's like, Draven, thank you. Your courageous actions have saved the Pokemon nationwide. I know how, I know it's not much, but please take this. We get ourselves the clear bell. And uh, there used to be a tower right here in Goldenrod City. But it, but it was old and creaky. So we replaced it with our radio tower. We dug up. Uh, we, we dug up that belt during the construction. I hear. Uh, I heard that it, all sorts of Pokemon lived in Goldenrod in the past. Perhaps that belt has some connection to the Tin uh, Tower in Ecrotech City. Ah, that reminds me. I overheard Team Rocket uh, whispering. Apparently, something's going on in the Tin Tower. I have no idea what it, what's happening. But you might have to take a look into it. Okay. I better go to my office. Huh. So, there is something going on at the Tin Tower. I wonder what that could be. And uh, there's an item right here. And we get ourselves an Ultra Ball. That's great. That's awesome. Okay. Alrighty. So, everything's going up our way, I guess. And, um, well, let's see. Does she give us anything? Let's see. Oh, you're our little savior. Will you take this as my thanks? We got ourselves a pink bow, which actually powers up any kind of normal type moves. I think I should give that to, uh... It's appropriate, I guess. I should give that to my, uh, my Teddy right here. Huh. Teddy. Quick Claw, yes. I switch it up, and yeah, you know what? I should use that amulet coin too. Um, yeah. Kid Thunder. And, uh, well, we'll see what happens with the other stuff right here. Alright, time to get the heck out of here. We are the heroes of the day. I'm feeling great. That is awesome. And uh, that guy's looking around. He's just like, what the hell is he doing here? I'm doing great. Look at it. Everybody's returned. I'm feeling happy. That's good. Alrighty. Alrighty. I'm feeling pretty awesome. Muscular. Yeah. Alrighty. Alright. 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 Okay, so... After all that, we are ready to go on to our next adventure, and that would probably be over at the Ecrotech City Tin Tower. So stay tuned, guys. In the next episode, we're going to go legendary. Let's see what happens after this. See you guys.